Calf milk replacers have a range of ingredients in them, primarily a whole milk powder and then a combination of other dairy ingredients. It also has a vitamin mineral premix in it, a prebiotic and coccidiostat in some of our range. Encar has been around for a very long time, since 1966. It's been made to a specific recipe and we don't ever deviate away from that. So in terms of the total solids, when you mix it 150 grams to a litre, the same nutrition as the calf would get from whole milk. So you can take out one litre of whole milk and replace it with uh, one litre of Encar. In terms of the fat and protein content, there's minimums that ideally make the product nutritionally correct for a calf. So you do want the calf milk replacer to be greater than 18% to be nutritionally correct and to be able to give the calf enough fat. Uh, ideally you want that, milk, that fat source coming from milk too because you can't get the same fatty acid profile through other sources of fat such as vegetable fats. The key one is you lose a short chain fatty acid butyrate that's only found naturally in, in milk fat. Once it's blended we carry out testing in certified laboratories um, and we test for things like fat, protein, the functionality of the powder so how it'll mix on a farm um, to make sure it's consistent. We also do food safety testing, so ensure there's no foreign matter. What sets Ancalf apart is its consistency. Every batch is tested and goes through a series of quality steps to ensure that it's of the highest standard, its nutritional composition. So calf milk replacer at certain times of the year, like when a farmer has run out of transition milk or colostrum, can play an economic benefit to farming operations. And if you're feeding a reasonable number of calves, that can be quite a considerable saving. So definitely worth looking at at certain times of the year. So ANCAP is very easy to use on farm, providing you use the correct uh, temperature. Uh, make sure you've got good buckets, a whisk or any sort of blending system you've got on, on farm. What's really important when you're mixing ANCAP is actually ensuring that you're putting in half the water first and then mixing in the powder and topping up to your required amount. It does make it a little trickier when you put the powder on top of the full amount of water and try and mix it and so it is really important to follow the instructions on the pack and ideally to feed it at the calf's body temperature. So when choosing a calf milk replacer, I think what's really important from what farmers tell us is they don't want to have an issue on farm. One sick calf is one too many. So we need to provide them with a milk powder that's going to be good quality, consistent and ensure they get the growth rates and the health benefits they want to rear good healthy calves and if they are future producing cows that they get good heifers and in the long term good producing cows.